Life wasn't always a walk in the park for me. I grew up in Long Beach, California, in an environment where success wasn't exactly handed to you on a silver platter. I had my share of struggles, but I also had a dream, and that dream was to make it in the music industry. And guess what? I made it happen. So how did a kid from Long Beach become Snoop Dogg, an international superstar? It's simple. I had a vision, I had a dream, and I worked my tail off to make it a reality. That's what I want to share with you today. The keys to success, Snoop Dogg style. First and foremost, you got to believe in yourself. No one else will believe in you if you don't. I believed in my talent, even when others doubted me. People will try to bring you down. They'll say you can't do it. But you have to look in the mirror every morning and say, I got this. Confidence is the first step on the road to success. Next, you've got to hustle hard. Success doesn't come easy, my friends. I spent countless hours perfecting my craft, writing rhymes, and honing my skills. I wasn't afraid to put in the work because I knew that's what it took to make it. Whether you want to be a rapper, a doctor, or an astronaut, you've got to put in the work. There's no substitute for hard work. Now, here's the real secret sauce. Stay true to yourself. Don't try to be someone you're not just to fit in or please others. I've always been Snoop Dogg, unapologetically me, and that's what made me stand out. People appreciate authenticity, and they'll recognize it when they see it. So, be you. Be unique. And don't be afraid to stand out from the crowd. But remember, it's not all about you. It's about the people you surround yourself with. Your circle should be filled with people who support your dreams and push you to be better. I've been blessed to work with some incredible artists and producers, and they've played a huge role in my success. So choose your team wisely, and together you can achieve greatness. Now let's talk about adversity because it's part of the journey. There will be setbacks, failures, and haters. Oh, the haters. But that's just life's way of testing you. You've got to keep your head up, stay focused on your goals, and keep pushing forward. It's not about how many times you fall. It's about how many times you get back up. And speaking of goals, set them high. Don't settle for mediocrity. Dream big and work towards those dreams every single day. When I was coming up, I dreamed of winning Grammy Awards, performing on stages all over the world, and becoming a household name. And you know what? I made those dreams a reality because I never stopped working towards them. But success isn't just about money and fame. It's about giving back, too. I've always believed in using my platform to make a positive impact on my community, whether it's through my music, my charity work, or my advocacy. I want to leave a legacy that's about more than just me. So find a way to give back, no matter how big or small. And lastly, always stay hungry. Even when you achieve success, never get complacent. Keep pushing yourself to new heights. Keep learning and keep evolving. The moment you think you've made it and you stop trying, that's when someone hungry is going to pass you by. So there you have it, my friends. The Snoop Dogg Guide to Success. Believe in yourself, hustle hard, stay true, surround yourself with the right people, embrace adversity, dream big, give back, and always stay hungry. That's how you make it happen, no matter where you come from or what you want to achieve. Remember, life is a journey, and success is a marathon, not a sprint. So, lace up your sneakers, stay focused on the finish line, and don't let anything or anyone hold you back. You've got this, and I believe in you. Now go out there and make your dreams a reality. Peace and love, y'all. Let's discuss the importance of authenticity. In a world that often demands conformity, staying true to who you are is an act of courage. It's essential to embrace your quirks, your individuality, and your uniqueness. Authenticity is not just liberating, it's magnetic. When you're genuine, you inspire others to be genuine too. 
passion is the fire that fuels our journey. Whatever your dreams may be, hold on to them with unwavering dedication. I've always believed that passion is the driving force behind every remarkable accomplishment. It's what makes the impossible possible. Resilience has been my steadfast companion throughout my career. I've faced challenges, both professionally and personally, that could have easily broken me. But resilience is about bouncing back, no matter how many times life knocks you down. Remember, setbacks are not failures. They're opportunities for growth. Support from loved ones is invaluable. Surround yourself with people who believe in your dreams, who stand by you through thick and thin. Lean on your support system in times of doubt and celebrate your victories with them. Success is sweeter when shared. Learning is a lifelong journey. No matter how accomplished you become, never stop seeking knowledge and self-improvement. Curiosity is a powerful driver of growth and discovery. Embrace new experiences and push your boundaries. Empathy and kindness should be at the core of our interactions with others. In a world that can often be harsh, a little compassion goes a long way. Understand that everyone is fighting their own battles, and a small act of kindness can make a significant impact. Lastly, making an impact is the highest form of success. It's not just about personal achievements. It's about how you use your influence to create positive change. Whether it's advocating for a cause, supporting the less fortunate, or standing up for justice, your actions can shape a better world. In conclusion, I want to leave you with this message. Embrace your authenticity. Follow your passions. Bounce back from adversity. Cherish your support system. Never stop learning. Practice empathy and kindness, and use your influence to make a positive impact. Let's start with the power of belief. Believing in yourself is the foundation of everything you want to achieve. When I was a young kid, I had a dream of making music that people all around the world would listen to. But there were times when I faced rejection and doubt. People told me I was too young, too inexperienced, or that it just wasn't possible. But deep down, I knew what I wanted, and I believed in myself. That belief gave me the strength to keep going, even when things got tough. Your belief in yourself is your superpower. It's what will carry you through the hard times and keep you moving forward. So no matter what dream you're chasing, hold on to that belief and let it fuel your determination. Next, let's talk about passion. I discovered my love for music at a young age, and that passion has been my driving force. It's what's kept me going, even when I face challenges. Find something you're truly passionate about, something that sets your soul on fire, and pursue it with everything you've got. Passion is like a magnet. It attracts opportunities, and it keeps you motivated even when the going gets tough. Now, I want to talk about something that's really important to me, mental health. It's okay not to be okay sometimes. We all have our struggles, and it's crucial to reach out for help when you need it. I've been there, and I've learned that seeking support is a sign of strength, not weakness. Take care of your mental health because it's the foundation of everything else in your life. Life is a journey, and it's not always a straight path. There are twists and turns, highs and lows. But every experience, even the difficult ones, shapes who you are becoming. Don't be afraid to make mistakes, to stumble and fall. It's all part of the process. Embrace those moments, learn from them, and use them to grow stronger. Surround yourself with positive influences. The people you choose to spend your time with can have a significant impact on your mindset and your success. Seek out those who support your dreams, who believe in you, and who uplift you. And remember, you have the power to choose your circle. Let go of toxic relationships that hold you back. Set goals and create a vision for your life. Having a clear direction gives you something to work towards. It could be big or small, short-term or long-term, but having goals provides motivation and a sense of purpose. Write them down, make a plan, and take consistent steps towards them. Stay curious and keep learning. Life is an incredible teacher, and every experience is an opportunity to grow and evolve. Don't be afraid to step out of your comfort zone and try new things. The more you learn, 
the more you'll discover about yourself and the world around you. Finally, remember the power of giving back. One of the most fulfilling things in life is helping others. Use your platform, your skills, or your time to make a positive impact. It's not just about personal success. It's about how you can contribute to making the world a better place. In conclusion, I want you to know that you are capable of achieving greatness. You have unique gifts and talents that the world needs. Believe in yourself, follow your passion, take care of your mental health, embrace the journey, surround yourself with positivity, set goals, keep learning, and give back. Life is a beautiful adventure, and it's yours to create. I believe in you, and I'm excited to see the incredible things you'll accomplish. So, go out there, chase your dreams, and never stop believing in yourself. I did not have a rich father. Not from, uh, you know, well-educated. I said I tried three times for university. All failed. For the last time, I went to the teacher's college, which was considered the third or fourth class of my city. But I think that is the best university I've ever had. Better than Harvard and Wharton. I applied for Harvard for 10 times. All failed. They don't even want to see me. You know, terrible. And I, I think that is a normal life. It was so difficult at that time. I was so frustrated. Because I taught in the university. My pay was $10 a month. It was not easy. But I believe that something, something is waiting for me there. And I have to work hard to prove myself. That was the tough experience. And I never thought I was smart. Nobody believed that I could be successful. Because everybody said, well, this guy think differently, think crazily. You know, they think about something that never worked. Nobody agreed with. As I said, I believe it. Because I saw the computer in 1994 when I went to the USA. I think this thing could be big. I never thought it would be that big like today. Honestly, people say you're smart, you're, you have a big vision. I'm lucky to know a lot of famous people. Bill Gates, Warren Buffett, Jack Welch, Larry Page, Mark Zuckerberg. I would like to share with you the difference between those people and other people. They are always optimistic for the future. They never complain. They always try to solve the problems of the others. And I think, where is the opportunity? The opportunity li always lies in the place where people complain. Some people sit there complain. You think, mm, if I can solve that complaint, that's the opportunity. Because when everybody agrees why this opportunity should be yours. Because a lot of people don't agree with it. And you think this is good. Think carefully and find a group of people working together. And making sure the people working with you together believe the dreams. Whether investors believe in this or not, whether your friends believe it or not, whether your parents believe it or not, that's not important. You believe it. Your team believe it. And work day and night on this. That's how the things happens. Everybody is the same. Because we are stuck from the same line. The best, the best assets you have is that you are young. Don't complain. Let the other people complain. Those people complain, those people who spill. Think about how you can make things different. Use your own brain to think. Is that an opportunity inside? Is there anything I can do that make the difference? Think about this. And then when you think about this, start to do it. I saw a lot of people, young people, have fantastic ideas every evening. But in the morning, they go to the office same again. Make the move. Make the action. To everybody, to any person, tomorrow is new. So you have to work very hard, right? Either work for the others or work for yourself. And I choose the way, work my, for myself. But working for myself, that means working for the society. If you really want to work for yourself, think about the others. Making sure you help others. Because only when the other, ha other people are successful, when the other people are happy, you will be successful, you will be happy. Hey everyone, it's Wheezy F. Baby. And I'm here to talk to you about my journey, a journey that's been anything but ordinary. You see, I've always believed that life is what you make of it. 
and I've made mine a thrilling roller coaster ride. I came from the streets of New Orleans, a place that's not always kind to dreamers. But I had a dream, a dream of becoming one of the greatest rappers in the world. And let me tell you, it wasn't an easy path. I faced obstacles, criticism, and doubt from many corners. People told me I couldn't do it, that I wasn't good enough, but I didn't listen. I knew that success wouldn't come overnight. It required hard work, dedication, and a relentless pursuit of my craft. I spent countless hours writing rhymes, perfecting my flow, and battling other rappers in the underground scene. I knew I had to pay my dues and prove myself. And then the opportunity of a lifetime came knocking. I was signed by Cash Money Records and my career took off. But that success didn't mean I could rest on my laurels. I kept pushing the boundaries of my music, experimenting with different styles and collaborating with some of the biggest names in the industry. I believed in evolving, in never staying stagnant. But life isn't just about music. It's about resilience and overcoming adversity. I've faced personal challenges and legal issues that could have derailed me. But I didn't let them define me. I used those experiences as fuel to keep moving forward. I've always been unapologetically myself. I've never been afraid to be different, to stand out, to be controversial. And that's a lesson I want to share with all of you. Embrace your uniqueness. Don't conform to what others expect of you. Be true to who you are, no matter how unconventional that may be. I've also learned the value of persistence. Success isn't a straight line. It's a series of ups and downs. There were times when my career seemed on the decline, but I didn't give up. I kept pushing, kept innovating, and kept believing in myself. In conclusion, my life is a testament to the power of self-belief, hard work, resilience, and staying true to who you are. Whether you're chasing your dreams in music, business, or any other field, remember that it's okay to be different, to face setbacks, and to keep going no matter what. Life's a journey, and it's up to you to make it an extraordinary one.